Hi guys, what I'm going to do with this is very simple. I'm not going to make an aeroplane with it at the moment. I just want to check out the thrust control because the idea is I should be able to steer it by varying the thrust between the two motors because that's how this one flies normally. And I was thinking of making a boat to test that, a very simple boat. just a styrofoam plate and then I thought I wonder what would happen if I just glue some beads on the bottom because there'll be low friction I just wonder if that'll blow across the ground or across my kitchen floor because it'll be low friction there might be enough power to actually push it along not as a hovercraft or a ground effect car vehicle just something that's sliding along on some low friction bearings. That's it, up together. Charging it at the moment. But it's just a polystyrene plate or styrofoam plate with the motors off the helicopter just hot glued in place and the receiver and the lipo still attached as they were before they'll slot in the middle there for flying or whatever we want to call it and underneath I've just put three plastic beads to give us minimum ground contact so when it's charged up, we'll go and try it out. All charged up and ready to go. So I'll set the camera up and see how we get on. As usual, I haven't really got the space to demonstrate this. If we were actually flying, and we were out in a nice big field, then we could have gentle left turns and right turns. But in here, we've, we're pretty limited. We'll just have to see if we can get a bit of left and then a bit of right. So I'll try and hold the controller up so you can see it. So Left, right. Oh, too far. turn there didn't we? <laughs> well, I think that shows the general idea it does work so we've got um, differential thrust giving us directional control but I need a much bigger space to be able to do it I was thinking of trying it in my bath but obviously that would be far too small to do this which is why I came up with the idea of putting some beads on the bottom of it and trying it on the kitchen floor I think we've proved it works and we've proved I have I don't have enough space to do this. <laughs> That'll do for now.